don't already know me, um, obviously I'm Thomas Ryden. Um, I'm 25 years old, just. Basically, been riding bikes since I was a little kid. I rode dirt bikes to start off with when I was about 10, had a break, didn't ride until I was about 16 again. Um, big goal was always wanting to go racing. My whole plan was always to go racing, so I started working in bike shops so I could afford to go racing. Um, I've been riding 600s now um, on the tracks since 2010, semi-professionally since 2013. Um, still going at it, never going to give up. Hopefully we'll come away with a few Aussie titles, that sort of thing. But um, yeah, that's, that's pretty much where it all started and how I got to be where I am now. Main goal at the moment, basically for myself, um, is to try and get to the level and get to the point where one can afford it and also um, be at a competitive level and fitness to be able to, to, to get an opportunity to challenge some of the guys on the world stage. Um, it's, it's all good and well being here and, and, and fighting with the guys um, and, and looking to get podiums and, and working towards getting an opportunity up the front here in Australia but the real end goal is you know, to, to get some international experience, to get to get to have a shot at something like that, whether it be a wild card at Phillip Island or, or a wild card in another race overseas in World Super Sport or just an opportunity to actually get there to, to give it a go, you know what I mean? You never want to leave anything um, with doubt or with what if and um, slightly stubborn and haven't really learnt a, a way of giving up yet, so which I don't really think is in my DNA, so I'm definitely keen to um, try and get an opportunity to prove myself on on an international level. Um, that's that's the end goal. Um, I think that's every racer's goal at, at one point in time is to, to get to a point where he can push the limits and, and, and uh, love to actually be able to race in the world championship. Biggest thing of all, I just like to um, say a massive thank you to everybody that's um, there supporting SWR and supporting the event and um, come along and also the people that are all behind me. Sadly, I won't be able to make it, there's been a change of plans, um, I won't actually be able to be at the event. Um, I was really looking forward to it, I just can't make it there, Yamaha Australia YD is holding a test day down at Winton. Um, I've been invited to go, it's not an opportunity I can really turn down, um, getting track time, you know, good solid testing time on the bike at a racetrack I'm going to be racing at, uh, it's something that's really hard to turn down these days, especially you know, when you're propped here, it's a bit short of funds. So, sadly, priority takes takes part, and I've, I've got to be down there. And a massive thank you to Yamaha and YD for the guys for giving me the opportunity to come out and ride. A massive thank you to, to everybody that's there supporting the event, supporting SWR, Sydney Fruit Runners, myself. Um, none of it can be done with, without you guys. You know, even if you can't chip in and help out, you know, just knowing that you're there as support behind me helps me motivation to just keep pushing, knowing that there's people here in my local community backing it. You know, like 100% cheers and thanks heaps to you guys.